what a great place to start our adventure at Knox Mountain Virtual. Yeah, from here we're going to be venturing north to a little town of Cherryville, then off to Vernon for some target caching. Join us! <laughs> We're right outside Cherryville and we're looking for a multi cache. And this multi, if we've got it right, the first coordinates start here at this sign and it's amazing. It's Check this very out. Very well done. The coordinates are listed on a north and a west post. Well, you should really check this out. These are the north coordinates. You gotta come here yourself to find them. The west ones weren't as tricky because we figured out what to look for and they're on the tag on this nail. I'm just blown away by the way they did this at stage one. It's very intricately done, but I love it. Yeah. Worth a favorite point. Just amazing. And I hope we can actually find the cash. <laughs> let's, let's go. Let's go. I got it. This was a very clever 4-1 multi. Yeah, and we targeted this one because we don't have a 4-1 multi. Yes, we do. Now we do. Now we do. <laughs> Turns out we had nothing to worry about. We got the right coordinates and we got the cache. A stop along the way, which I wasn't expecting to be so hard. This is for a 5-4 fizzy challenge cache. And it's in that tree up there. Uh, just down the way, I tried to go up, got to the very top, and I just couldn't get up onto the grass. And I think we're just not going to be able to get this one. <laughs> just a little bit out of our reach, but it says it's hanging in an evergreen at the top of the hill. Darn it! Lyric last tried too, but unfortunately, we just can't get up there. We're not confident enough and we're not mountain climbers. Oh, very good. There it is. Our search for the multis on our target list was a bit of a bust. So we decided to look for one of Mrs. Pumpkin's caches. And this one's called Thank You Karen. And with a title like that, we hoped we'd be lucky. Turned out pretty good, even though it was in a juniper. Now we're gonna finish the other adventure lab. First one's already done. And then we're gonna go have a snack. It's gonna be off to our right by about 30 meters, just up here. Boy, I hope it's not up there. <laughs> we got it, and it was nice to add this one to our adventure for the day. Got it. Yep, we're finishing up with Ellie Cat 21 for a four and a half four to get one more square for our fizzy grid. And she got it, and I came out to help sign it. I almost went in the wrong direction. <laughs> Glad I went the other way, because this is a big drop. It's a spooky spot from here. You've got to take a look at down here. It's a long way down. It wouldn't be a brutal fall, but it sure would have hurt. And you'd go rolling for a while until a tree stopped your uh, forward progress. <laughs> anyway... That's when she says, Keep watching, there's more caches to be found. And where will geocaching take, take you? you? <laughs>